Hello YouTube, this is my first video, and uh, in this video I'm going to show you my favorite packages on my iPhone. So this iPhone here. Uh, here's one in progress that I have. It's called uh, Auto 3G. If you notice, I'm on... Let's see if I could zoom in here. I'm on Edge. Unlock. Losing signal, get signal back, and in 3G. Another application that I, or package that I have, is called InfiniBoard. Get my device to have as many applications as I want on one page. Um, another package that I use is my Y, which I could stream my infer my. Uh, my internet connection on my phone to my laptop or I could uh, oops or I could s you let other devices pick up my internet connection with Wi-Fi tethering which allows me to have my phone has a Wi-Fi hotspot another package I use a lot is uh, Talert which allows me to pick up uh, text messages on any application without going to my SMS or my text app. Let's see, Loading City. Um, I use a bunch of different packages. I got a bunch of favorite different packages. Um, and I will show you how to get them for free. Like one package I use a lot is uh let's see um and there's infinite board uh, IntelliDial allows me to um make a call on my favorites my favorite list on my phone on lock screen so if my phone was turned off like this press it once press it again loading and teledial I could call my people on my favorites list press it again it's gone unlock oh, there again look at, since I put my phone on lock screen my phone went to edge and now it's trying to get back to 3G might take a moment because I locked it and unlocked it really quick there we go edge now 3G um, another one I use a lot is uh, lock info which allows me to uh, uh, check my mail, my calendar, and everything on my lock screen. My 3G lets me connect uh, my applications to my 3G and makes my applications thinks it's running off of my uh, off of, of a Wi-Fi hotspot. My Y is something that allows me to uh, use my phone as a a Wi-Fi hotspot. It's uh, 3 in the morning, so I'm like, super tired. Um, Quick Reply is another package that I use to reply from a text message from an app. Shrink allows me to uh, shrink my app apps on my home screen so they become smaller. Uh, anyway, to get the sources, or to get these packages, you gotta add some sources in Cydia, or in your in your Cydia. The way you do that is to go to Manage Sources, and you're gonna add these two sources that I use most frequently, which is Excelize, this highlighted blue one, and Repo and Sanly I, which is this highlighted blue one. And uh, these packages have cracked applications in Cydia, or packages. 
and uh, the way you get them is find the applic or the package like um Infiniboard, click and or press into it, then click modify, and then for you it will be install, and so click it will be on the top. So click it, and um, let's see. I'll just show you on it on something I don't have already. I pick my contacts, install, it will take you to another page, install, and then you'll hit confirm right here, and then it will just add, or it will load, but uh, oh man, I didn't know I was going to do this. But to add these sources, again, you go to Manage, Sources, and then it will pop up on the top right and it will say Edit. Come on. I don't know why it's taking so long. There we go. Manage, Sources, Edit, Add, and type in this exact word Cydia S Y D oops D I A dot X oops X S E L L I Z E X L I S dot com just like that and then click add source I already have it so I won't add it and again use the other one do the same exact thing edit add and then add r e p o um dot i n s a n uh, e l y i dot com add and then look for the for, look for packages that you like in either either Excelize or Insanely I. The reason why I'm not saying this source because it doesn't have as much stuff as Excelize and Insanely I. Uh, but uh, again, the sources will be typed into the description here at the bottom. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. And uh, if anyone wants to learn how to downgrade your device from 4.1 to anything under, just uh, send me a, uh, a comment or a message and I will show you how to get from 4.1 back down to 4.0 or even as low as 3.1.3 like I did. I was once on 4.1, but I went back because not as much stuff on Cydia as 4.0 yet. And so I just wanted to wait before I update my device again. I uh, hope you guys liked the video. Comment, subscribe, and uh, well for me, have a good morning. But for you, have a good day.